Hey everybody, it's Dawn Clicchio from Remax Diamond Realtors here in Central New Jersey. Last week, I took you to three of my favorite places in South Plainfield, which happens to be my hometown. This week, it is all about the food. Thank you so much for being here with me today. Um, if you haven't already and you want to learn more about South Plainfield real estate and Middlesex County in general, please consider subscribing to my channel, giving me a thumbs up and hitting the bell for notifications. I upload new videos every Wednesday morning and I would love for you to join me. Today, I'm going to talk about six of my favorite food spots in South Plainfield. The last one actually has a South Plainfield tradition that's kind of cool. The first one is Mr. Subs. Mr. Subs is open Monday through Saturday from 10 to 8, and on Sunday, they're there until 6. It is your traditional sub place, your Italian sub, roast beef, turkey and provolone. They also have hot subs, so cheese steak. They also have, have a chicken cutlet sub. So it's obviously a breaded chicken cutlet with lettuce, mayo, um, really, really good. If any of you are familiar with Tasty Subs in Edison, that used to be my go-to place. That was the only place that had really amazing subs. And thank goodness now Mr. Subs is here, so we have some place a little bit more local, so it doesn't take me 45 minutes round trip to get subs for dinner. But check it out, Mr. Subs is number one. Number two is Chichio's Pizzeria. They are located on Maple Avenue in a little strip mall. And when my son, before he went away to college, um, we always used to have pizza calzone night. Um, one night a week when it was just me and him, we would order pizza and calzone. Um, they, obviously they have hot subs, they have dinners. Um, my favorite pizza is the sausage because they actually shred the sausage instead of those big chunks of sausage. I was never a fan of that, but they shred the sausage so that when it is in the oven and they bake it, it actually crisps on the ends. It is so yummy. So that is my second recommendation for pizza. We have a ton of pizza places in town and they're all really, really good, but Chichio, it's my go-to. Number three is diner food. I mean, can anybody live without diner food? So number three is the Park Ave Diner. Obviously, because of its name, it is located on Park Avenue. Uh, they actually had a fire there. I want to say it was last year. It seemed like it was closed forever. But they are open. They have outdoor seating because of COVID. So if you're somebody that loves great diner food, I highly recommend the Park Ave Diner. My number four is Palo's Barbecue and Restaurant. They are closed on Monday and Tuesday, but they're there Wednesday through Sunday from 11 to 9. Um, the food there is amazing. I typically get the filet mignon. My husband's favorite is steak on a stone. They literally bring out this flaming hot stone with your raw piece of steak and you put butter on the stone and then you slice the steak and cook it as you eat it. So each piece is, you know, piping hot and fresh. Um, he loves it. I like them to bring mine already cooked because if I wanted to cook, I would just stay home. Palos also has amazing chicken. Um, a lot of times we'll do takeout from there. You can get either a whole or a half chicken with rice and french fries. Uh, they also have seafood. So all your traditional barbecue-y kind of um, Portuguese food. They also have a bar. So they have sangria, which is absolutely delicious. Um, my preference is white sangria but they do have the red also. So I would highly suggest checking out Paolo's Barbecue Restaurant. Number five for me is Angelina's Tavern. Now for all you lifers or your South Plainfield people that have been here a long, long time, you know that forever that place was Flanagan. Um, when they said they were for sale and they closed, I think a lot of people in South Plainfield were really, really bummed. But I will tell you that Angelina's has stepped up. Great tavern food. They also have um, Italian food. If any of you guys um, like Angelina's, do me a favor, leave a comment down below, let me know, give me a thumbs up. Um, I think most people agree that are from South Plainfield that Angelina's really stepped up when Flanagan's closed and um, I think we're all really, really happy. So check out Angelina's. Number six and the last one for today is Casey's Corner. 
Now again, um, I was born and raised here in South Plainfield. Casey's Corner has been there forever, for as long as I can remember. It is a great pub. It has all kinds of pub food, sandwiches, burgers, seafood. It opens every day at 11.30 and they serve lunch and dinner. It's where all of South Plainfield goes. Um, and the one tradition that has been around for as long as I can remember is that on Thanksgiving Eve, all the South Plainfield alumni go there. All the kids come home and they all meet up there to see each other and reconnect. So Casey's Corner is a staple in South Plainfield. Great food, again, great people. And um, it's the go-to place for the college kids when they come home and they wanna see their friends. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got a little bit more information about South Plainfield. If you have any questions about South Plainfield or other towns in Middlesex County, uh, leave a comment below, I will absolutely answer. Do me a favor, if you find this information helpful, um, please subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you here every Wednesday with me. Take care, God bless, and I will see you real soon.